Hello and welcome to the Oval for day four of the fifth and final Ashes Test match. Here to preview all the action is Australia all-rounder Mitch Marsh. Mitch, Australia trailing by 382 runs, still need those two wickets. Big mountain to climb, what gives you confidence Australia can do it? Uh, yeah, it's certainly a big mountain to climb. Um, I think the confidence I've got in this group is that we're never going to give up. We've fought hard this whole series. We found ourselves in positions where we've been behind the game. and We've been able to, to wrestle it back and um, you know, win games from... Um, pretty bad situation, so um, this is no different. Um, we want to show the, the Australian spirit for, for our fans and people back home, and, and hopefully we can have a good two days. Hasn't been our best couple of days so far, but um, we'll fight hard. What's been the message from the captain and the coach after three days play? Keep fighting. Um, you know we've probably let a few opportunities slip throughout the the, um, the last couple of days, but we know that. Um, this is a great batting wicket still. There's going to be a little bit of rough out there for Leach for our left-handers, but apart from that, it's a really flat wicket. So um, a couple of big partnerships we've seen in this series. Run, run chases have been, uh, have been had, and all it takes is one or two big partnerships. So um, that's the plan for us. You mentioned the drop catches. What do you reckon has been the difference between the two sides so far? Drop catches? <laughs> Um, look, at this level of cricket, test match cricket, you've got to take your opportunities. And if you don't take your opportunities, you get hurt, and we've shown that. I think in the, the test um, previous to this, we've been amazing. We've held our catches and, and won big moments. But um, unfortunately, this test match, we've let a few slip. But um, that's cricket, that's life. We move on, and we've got two days to play, and hopefully we can have a, a good couple of days. Seven wickets for you in the match. What does it mean for you to get the reward and be able to capitalise on that opportunity? Oh, it's been, it's been fun. Look, I just... I've tried my guts out. That's what I love doing for this team. Um, hopefully, you know, well, hopefully the other boys get the wickets first. But um, you know, if I need to, take, need to take a couple more wickets today, but more importantly, um, I want to make sure I can have a big partnership with someone with the bat. Hopefully, um, I felt really good in the first innings, and um, hopefully, we can chase these runs down. Seven wickets could have been eight uh, with the Denley LBW. What was going on with that review? Did you want to review it? How did you and Payne come to deciding not to review it? Yeah, I think well, the lads behind the wicket thought it was probably going down a leg a bit. Um, when you're in that sort of, sort of situation, 15 seconds goes really quickly. So, um, yeah, one of those ones we probably should have reviewed it, but uh, we didn't and we moved on. We cost us probably 40 runs, but um, that's the way it goes sometimes. Despite all that, are you back in the fast bowling cartel WhatsApp group? Yeah, I've never left, mate. I'm a founding member now. So uh, I'm a stalwart. <laughs> Who's going to have a big day? Big chase on the cards for Australia. Who's going to have a big day for the Aussies? Look, I think we all need to have a big day. Um, we spoke about it last night. Um, we've seen big chases um, chase down this series. And like I said before, this is a really good batting wicket still. So um, it's all about partnerships, batting for each other. Um, if we get one or two big partnerships, we'll know their change room. We'll, we'll start thinking, you know, with, with the way this series has gone, there's always been twists and turns. So um, it's going to be a huge effort from us. We know that. We're behind the game. but. Australians love that, so hopefully we can um, have a good day today. Thanks, Mitch. Good luck. Cheers, mate.